Yo, what's up guys, it's Barox again here, back at it again, and it's another day once again, that means the new Aimblox update dropped, so let's get right into it. And to start it off with, we once again got a new anime skin, this time it's the Nilia skin for the AK5C, and I do like this one way more than the Amy one honestly, don't get me wrong, they are both pretty nice, but the AK5C has a bigger gun model, which allows you to see more of the skin, so yeah, good skin, and it only costs 400 robux. Next on, we got two new skins, the first one being this potato skin, and I don't know who in the discord wanted this, but here it is now I guess, but the second skin called the smoked skin, is actually probably now the best skin we got in the game. It's just so damn clean to use, especially with the Odin, because it has such a big view model and gun model, so two new nice skins, next on. Alright, they added a new experimental game mode called Shorty Snipers, it's just as it sounds like, you get a sniper, then a shotgun, simple as that. And yes, this one does replace the shotgun only game mode we had last week. Little dev note for you all, the mobile auto fire has been brought back into the training mode. Alright, now we get right into the gun balancing. Feels like it has been forever, but honestly. Anyways, we're starting them off with the M13, gaining a small buff to its movement speed, increasing the min damage from 12 to 15, and the max damage going from 16 to 30. You heard that right, the M13 now officially can 4 tap you like every other good AR, but to counter this, the fire rate has been reduced slightly to 780 from 810, and it has gotten considerably higher recoil now. Next on is the Chris Vector, also getting a little buff to the move speed, increasing the min damage from 7 to 10, and the max damage going from 18 up to 25, which also means it can 4 tap you now close range as well. But it also has gotten higher recoil now, which is definitely feelable, and reducing the headshot multiplier from 1.5 to 1.2. And lastly, with the balance changes, we got the CAC 9, once again getting a move speed buff from 1.1 to 1.22, making it go zoom zoom. The reload speed getting reduced to 1.8 seconds from 2 seconds, the headshot multiplayer being reduced to 1.3 from 1.5, and its min damage being increased from 12 to 13, and the max damage going up from 21 going up to 21 from 19 overall, pretty good buff. And lastly we got the bug fixes, training weapon getting stuck on the hotbar has been fixed, the moon base charger making a hotbar useless has also been fixed, mission main menu disappearing after opening a crate has also been fixed, and also you can now exit live ammo properly without it being bugged around. Alright, this was pretty much it with the new update, small but it did change some stuff to keep it fresh, so anyways, you guys know exactly what happens next, let's get into round 1. Interior in the and I think everyone knows what is up. We're playing competitive, of course, why wouldn't we? And there's my and there's my name friend that always names himself like me. He's a swag dude. Okay. Aim blocks, when are you gonna fix this corner? And obviously we're gonna try out this this gun, the 5C. I think everyone knows how good this gun is. I mean the thing is, this gun is still good. Like don't get me wrong. There's no way. Like I literally just woke up like an hour ago or maybe like, maybe woke up like 30 minutes ago. And the first thing I see is this guy. Oh my god. This thing is kind of shredding. Hello, my friend. He's my friend. Excuse me. Yeah, Tech 9 is actually. And we're also gonna rock the Tech 9 since it got a buff. The only gun that actually did get a buff that's actually decent, I guess. Um. Yeah, that doesn't work. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, anyways, how is it guys David? Hope it's going well. Man's been doing just fine. I hope you guys all have a nice weekend. Honestly, they butchered this gun so bad. In my opinion, they could have benefited more from a, like a 10% maybe... A 10% fire rate buff. Like if it's 5%, 10% more fire rate. Or almost all... Or like nerf the damage or like... Or like remove like... Like 10% of the damage and add the original fire rate back. If you watch my video when the thing released, this thing used to shoot like twice as fast pretty much. But it's still pretty strong though, so... Sadly, this lobby is almost pretty dead, so... That's about it though, that's fine. Anyways, so far, the ba it's actually weird that we got balance changes for once. Okay, yeah, it's actually pretty strong. Can't imagine it being good on range though. Okay, that hurt. And I'm a big ass scarecrow, so people can hit me pretty easily. Even though it doesn't feel really matter, hey. I still can't get over that we have so many anime skins in this game, I just can't get over this. It's so goofy. I approve of the Tech 9 as a, as a, as a valid secondary. 
I think they probably want to rival the Glock 18. Is what I guess they might want to do. Like, get a rival for the Glock 18 going. I approve of this gun. Anyways, it's your strand in the second round. Right, here we are already in the last round. It's Moros. This time it's Domination and I joined a bit late because... I thought there was a nice lobby online, but I was debated. What? If, if that is not a mobile player, I don't know. That was weird. Wait, is he che wait, 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 wait. This is interesting. I don't wanna, again, like, cut the cheater card, but that was weird, man. And if you look at the kill feed, he only gets headshots, too. Oh, yeah, he is cheating. Never mind. He is aim. Wait, is he actually... No, there's no way, actually, right? There's no way. There's no way this guy's cheating. Oh, yeah, he is cheating. Look, look, he's only getting headshots. Of course, I knew it. You don't beat me from this far. I told, I knew it. He, and yeah, he's lagging too. We need a vault kick system in this game. Actually, no, we don't. Yeah, he's absolutely, he's aimbotting so bad. Jesus Christ. I think, from, no, he left. But my friend is still, yeah, he's cheating. Okay. Okay, that's, that's just great, man. So if any aimblocks mods watch this video, mind banning this guy. Because this guy is... This is not very legit what he's doing right there. That's so goofy what he's doing. Yeah, it sucks, but he's still... The funny thing is, he's still worse than any power gun player. Because he paces like 20 times worse than I do. And just aimbot doesn't... And aimbot just doesn't make you great. You still need more than one. You just... You still need more than just good aim to be good in this game. I'm actually kind of sweaty right now. Yep, yeah, I got him though. He is... Yeah, if he loses this one, I'm tired. Nah, if he loses this, I'm tired. But then I'm done. But this guy is really not a good cheater either. The thing is, he's not very good. Honestly, I don't really care for you. I, I, all I want to do is win this. Yeah, he's aim. Yeah, yeah, he's aimbotting. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, look. He's only getting... Yeah, yeah, he's cheating so goddamn hard. Did my friend tell about this? You suck, man. Imagine cheating in aim blocks, man. This game is here to get better for aim, not war, not cheat. I'm pretty sure I can't outpeak him anyways. Actually, I can. He's just this bad. And by the way, I'm also very much not boosting right now because you would get the thing is, if I would boost right now, I would just get immediately deleted out of the air. Like, look! Now he's now he's probably changing his fucking aimbot settings or some bullshit. Pathetic. Snipers are balanced, by the way. Yeah, they lost. That's so goddamn hard. And by the way, the AK still kicks so hard. It still kicks your butt really badly. Yeah, and he's back to aimbotting again. Pathetic. And we still won that. And it's still match with a cheater. Well, anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and always subscribe. It's the best way to show me that you guys like the content that I make. But anyways, I hope you guys have a nice day. I'm Rosin, who's going to create that MVC's straight in the next one. Ciao, ciao.